Yo, what's going on guys? Cordy here and we got some more announcement for Marvel Rivals. They just announced the next character. They're becoming a villain. I'm, a, I'm team villain here. I like the villains, but Hela is going to be coming to the battlefield. I'm looking forward to this. I like Hela. She's a cool character. I like her design as well. The black and green with the spikes. She's really cool. They're classifying her as a duelist. So we know the classes are DPS, frontline and support. We just had Loki. He was considered a strategist, but he's going to be falling into the support category and they're classifying her as a duelist. So she is going to be a DPS going over her abilities and her powers. She is going to see, see more DPS than anything else, um, possibly a tank. So going over Hela and her abilities, she is the goddess of death. So she does, she does wield, you know, black magic. She has superhuman strength, speed, stamina, durability, control the undead. She can also teleport between the, the nine worlds in an instant. So she has a lot of these abilities from what I'm seeing, from what we see in like the MCU um, and then kind of the, the tag that they're giving her, the duelist. I feel like she's going to have more of abilities of like, you know, creating the sword that she did in the, in the MCU, throwing out the deadly bolts and just kind of wielding that black magic. So we'll probably see her more because she is classified as a duelist. So I might see like more hand to hand combat with her strength, her speed and like those reflexes. And that might be the kit that we're going with. She can also levitate as well with her cloak. Uh, there is a little bit of lore behind the cloak. She, If she doesn't wear the cloak, then half of her body is deformed. Uh, half of her body is old and decayed, while the other half is still you know, healthy and, and, and uh, beautiful. But while she's not wearing the cloak, she's very weak. Her powers are greatly reduced. I don't know if that's the lore that they're going to go with, if that's what they're going to go with. Maybe you have to do something with the ult to, to get your powers back. That's something that they could do with the, with the uh, cloak. But I think she's probably going to be kind of more simple. She's going to be more simplified. She's going to be, you know, wielding a sword, throwing out bolts and uh, levitating and just having, you know, superhuman strength. So she could be uh, a frontline DPS or just kind of like a, a main DPS. But regardless, we are going to see her. Hopefully we can get access to it, which is going to be in May 10th. So we'll be able to see more gameplay of her. Maybe we might see a little trailer or, or a leak. They're starting. It seems like they're starting to build up the launch, the alpha launch. Just um, they're putting out more content. So any more content comes up, I'll make sure to get that out to you guys. Until then, everyone take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.